I'm back, motherfuckers. That's all the energy we're getting for the entire stream today. Howdy, everybody. <laughs> Hope everybody's having a good day. Hope everybody's had a good uh, week. Good week. Week and a half without me. Hope everybody has survived through that. I know. I know. Not uh, not having your dear rye bread is a traumatizing experience, I'm sure. But I am back. I saw the eclipse. It was very, very nice. I am very... Very glad I went out and did that. Um, I went and saw family and friends during Easter. Last couple weeks have been very, very nice. Outside the collab with Hattie. So, y'all weren't completely without me. But you were, you, you were without me. Here, at least. Where I assume most of y'all come and actually care about me and shit. <laughs> uh, regardless, hope everybody is having a good day. I said that already. I, I, I'm getting back into the swing of things. I am... <laughs> I, I've gone effectively two... Almost two weeks without streaming. So, uh, getting back into the whole, like, um... Streamer brain half of things. Going to be just a little bit of a challenge. <laughs> I will do my best, though. And I have a... Probably not the best game in order to <laughs> do that. <laughs> no, I do like Harvestella. I like playing it. It's a chill game. It's definitely something good to get acclimated back into. However, it's, a, it's such a chill dialogue heavy game. <laughs> mm -mm. I don't know. We'll see. We shall see. We'll see what happens. Thankfully, it's not like um, it's not like Divinity where I have to do like a lot of thinking and stuff. That one, uh, brother, I was only playing that game because I had no other games to play on stream. <laughs> That was, uh, this is all I have. <laughs> Not this is what I think would be a good streaming game. But I made do. I made do. And I enjoyed myself. I did. It was a good time. I enjoyed Divinity. I won't go back to it. All, all you see on the YouTube channel is all you get. Speaking of the YouTube channel, I got a million fucking VODs. I need to, <laughs> I need to, uh, I need to publish. I've uploaded all of them. I have uploaded all the non like art stream VODs that at least solo art streams. I've uploaded all of those. I just need to like finalize them and publish them. It's all taken care of. Everything up until this point. So unless I want an extreme VOD backlog, I need to start getting on that like after stream today. Being it, which today might be a uh, shorter bit of a stream, simply just due to the fact that, guys, we drove overnight back home. I slept in the car, and I wouldn't even call it sleeping, more like five consecutive cat naps. I never hit, like, deep sleep. I took a fat fucking nap when I got home. I did that. But everything else? <laughs> no, no. That, yeah. Yeah. I'm not sure how much I got in me right now. I drank a monster earlier. I got some Zevias just to stimulate my uh, taste buds. I did some exercising earlier as well. So I'm trying to, I'm really trying to get back into exercising consistently. <clears throat> I really, really want to get back into it. And I've decided to say, fuck it. I got to give myself one like honest, genuine shot at taking care of myself for like at least a couple of years. Mm. It's like a requirement for me. Uh, so hopefully that uh, amounts to something. Mm. I can be like fucking Hattie, posting my abs on fucking Twitter, except I won't have abs because ab workouts ruin my back the most. But I can at least like work towards like, I don't know, a flat stomach or something. Uh, none of this has to do with farming. Let's get the farming, shall we? See here, there we go. All right, go ahead, turn that off. The music that is, and go ahead, hit that button. I'm sorry if the um, if uh, mic audio is a little iffy today. Um, here, actually, it seems a little. It, it seems like it's peaking a lot. Let me turn it down. Uh, crank it down to like 16. How's that? Is that is there less peaking now? I think so. Ba 
I like that they made a third one of those videos. Or uh, because I did this. Also gotta take a look at this real quick. Give me a sec. Do, do, do. What am I doing? Just go to advanced audio properties. Like a normal person. There we go. That should be better. I think. I is... Brother. I is Fugi. In between these two. I need to clean up my OBS really badly, dude. And Little Rise? I know. Did it, is it in alphabetical order? That's stupid. That's stupid. Alphabetical order is stupid. How the fuck did this happen? Uh, let's see. No, that's for fixing my color palette. There we go. <laughs> Every time I press 7, things just fucking... Okay, I'm still peeking. I know peeking isn't that bad, but I prefer to avoid it. Personally, this is just our personal preference. Okay, like that, like that. So nothing has changed. Hooray! Nothing has changed at all. all right, I think we should be good after that. Yeah, we're a lot better. Those are the audio levels I like. Uh, but yeah, when I, dude, I don't know what the fuck happened. I had so many like. I had so many issues with voice meter when I came back home. Because I had connect I brought my PC with me because I have Hell Divers brain rot and I wanted to play my and I brought my PC with me so I could play it while I was on vacation. And because of that, I I didn't bring my mic. I did not bring my Razor Siren Mini. So I had to make do with shit I found around the house, which included <laughs> A really old headset of mine that had a really shitty mic on it. But I tried to offset the shittiness by just running it through voice meter with my settings. It made it better. Not good. But, yeah, I just went ahead, ran through all of that. And everything was fine. And then suddenly, I come home. And nothing is fucking working. I had to like uninstall and reinstall voice meter and virtual audio cable, like all of this fucking bullshit I had to do. And I had to like completely like rebuild my fucking voice meter shit. Minus like the base settings that ad adjust the mic and make me sound more bearable. I think things are back to normal. This is weird little like, um, I won't point it out. I won't point it out just so nobody it's so just to spare y'all's ears so you don't notice it constantly like I am I think that thing on the mic has always been there though it would need to go to the chibi robo short and ch uh, check it out as well was pointing it out that something was uh iffy with my mic after that but I thought maybe she uh, just got used to me on my phone and I VC'd with her back up there. A, lo a loco nut. A loco conut. Loco conut. It's coconut milk and process of very sweet fruits with base ingredient for coconut milk. Why isn't it called loco coconut milk? It's stupid. They really didn't think that one through. <sighs> Uh, and then some withered crops. Cool leaf. Alright, let's look at my, um, stuff. Hey, Cece, welcome to the stream. Good to see you back, buddy. I hope you've been good the past, uh, week and a half without me. I know. It's been such a struggle. But we're alive. Mm. I'll also watch the collab with Hattie, in which case you're fine. Taking the exam today? Why? Well, I wish you luck on the exam, Cece. I hope it goes well. Don't overthink it too much. I got cram homework, dude. I got, I've got two fucking, I have a written assignment and a presentation I need to get done. The written assignment needs to be done by Sunday and I need to have the presentation done by uh, Tuesday. I'm a little fucked right now. <laughs> It'll be fine. It's my econ class. That's the, that's the subject I'm just good at. 
It'll be fine. <laughs> Mila. <laughs> Beep. Thank you for the resub. It's good to have you here, and I appreciate the resub a lot. I'm trying to get better. I'm trying to get better at accepting financial kindness from people. I'm doing my best. I'm trying not to scream like a banshee every time it happens. <laughs> I'm glad you're here. I'm glad you made it uh, relatively in time for beginning of the stream. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy yourself. I know you're going to be lurking today. So I hope I'm a uh, good background noise for killing cam uh, killing cannibals. I almost said killing cannibals. The soup. Go attack soup, Mill. That's an order. That's your mission for the day. See your voice from the well. Go to Hegon Canyon and defeat three Chlorogels. Go to Vinganaz and Lathe and tell Sheeran about Berg. Okay. So two things in uh, Lathe. Gotcha. I had to go to the store. I did buy soup. <laughs> uh, at least you weren't buying clothes there. Then I'd have to yell at you. My throat's sore. A little. My throat's a little sore, so I don't have to do that right now. Buying stuff the past few days. I've been buying gas. I was on gas duty during the trip. That's where most of my money went. Gas and feeding myself. Gone Canyon to kill three Chlorogels. I don't think I'll have time for that. I'm just gonna go uh, tell the lady that her husband has amnesia and to cope with the newfound reality she's found herself in. She'll be fine. Like books, but antique books, and even a suit. Ooh! But a good suit. Good fancy suit. Once went to an antique store um, back home, and they had a hardcover copy of the guidebook for Xenoblade Chronicles X. I'm telling you right now that guidebook isn't really useful, but as someone who just is a slut for Xenoblade X, I was very happy to own that. <laughs> I'm very happy I found that. Chair even got two books and tea pots. Oh, you went with chair? That's nice. And no, y'all were visiting each other just uh, over the break. Oh, hi, guys. Any news? You tell Sheeran about Berg. What? No way. Berg came back? Dot, dot, dot. He's at the doctor's? Okay, thanks. I'm coming, Berg. Go back to the clinic. <laughs> it doesn't even say, like, I should go over there to the clinic and visit on there. It just says, go back to the clinic. Now. <laughs> Granted, I get to see Crest, so it's totally worth it. <laughs> yeah, man, we spent three days together. Aw. I'm happy for y'all. <laughs> I like my friends hanging out. Makes me happy. I have to go and check around there next time. You're a crest sim. Look, man, I at none of the other girls so far have struck struck my fancy. It's just because I'm not far enough in their quest lines yet. So I'm still I'm still I'm still on pause. I'm still on pause with my final decision. But right now Crest is in the lead. So yeah. <laughs> Berg. I'm fine. I'm ready to go in. We watch movies and cringe. Yeah, that sounds like chair activities. Rise, you're back. And you brought someone. Is she Berg? Oh, wait, no, this is a lie. Rise, you're back. And you brought someone. Is she Berg's? Berg, where's Berg? I sent him outside to start eating more dirt. He's starting to cough up blood, so that must mean it's working. <laughs> I spoke to her about the state of Berg's health. 
In normal circumstances, it would be nice to share a nice story of our travels with her instead. Like that time I dragged this face through the dirt. And that time I dragged his face through sand. And that time I dragged his face through dirt again. <laughs> sure you'll get another chance to. Yeah. Berg, why won't you open your eyes? Berg, why won't you say anything? It's almost like you're sick or something. <laughs> I'm sorry, miss. This is all my fault. If only I hadn't told him to take on that request. The dirt dragon has absolutely nothing to do with this whatsoever. Tell me, Chris, when is Berg gonna wake up? I can't say for sure, but I can not say we'll do everything I can, so don't give up just yet. The best thing I would recommend is keep this man far the fuck away from him. I've had to fight him off like three times. Chris, would it be bad for him if we, I mo if we moved him back to his house? That would be fine, but who would look after him there? I will. I'm the one who's been looking after his house all the time he's been gone. I see. Then I'll leave him in your hands. Look, I'm caring. <laughs> I'm sorry, but the joke we've been making about why. It's the least I can do. Feet first, face down, through the ground. That's what Mama used to tell me. <laughs> Thank you, everyone. <laughs> uh, bro, we just got back. Aren't you tired? I took a nap. Thank you very much. Besides, I might make this a short stream if I don't have the energy for it. Your butt should have at least nap. I did nap! Brothers! We've been here. I've been here. Back at home for like 12 hours. Y'all think I ain't napped. Guys. I'm fine. <laughs> there. <laughs> we took a four hour nap. That was about how long mine was. Thank you for helping me find Berg, Rise. Lie just left town. I had to force him out. <laughs> Whoever taught that man how to carry another human being needs to be arrested. I really appreciate all your help. It's thanks to you we managed to get Berg back home. Talk to me whenever you need anything. Thanks, I will. Still about to go back to sleep. We got a 2.30 a.m. shift. Yeah, I'm gonna fix my sleep schedule back up tonight. 1,000 gorillas. I'm here for you, Berg. That's why I'm staring at the ceiling. <laughs> Instead of at the bed where you're laying. I was actually talking about the wall this entire time. We got me so tired, yeah. We made our bed, we must lie in it. Because that's where we're going to pass out. Mm. Yep. Alright, 7 p.m. Can I upgrade any of my sheet? Actually, I don't think this is the upgrade. Welcome. Yeah, this is other thing. I can increase my farm size? Didn't know that. Please, come again. Alright, so I can't buy multiple things at once. He's not a... He's not a masochist. I'm a masochist. I pronounce that right. I know what I'm doing. Alright, where, where's, where's the sword shop? Sword shop with the low-key gilf. There she is. Uh, Venus Twin Blades. Okay. Everything is fine. I can upgrade my shit again. <laughs> I can be selfish. Eight out of twelve. 
Yeah, I'd rather everybody else be level four. There we go. I have 6,000 girls left. We only have one shift this week anyway. We don't have rides for another shift, which is okay. We will be head to bed in about 30 minutes. We've been up for two and a half hours. Ugh. That's gonna be rough. I hope, I wish y'all a good, easy getting back to sleep. I know how fucking hard that can be after I nap. asshole at the entrance seven eggs here with Estina has to say it in your step I think we'll go over there tomorrow let's do some more quest things so we see if I actually want to fuck crest by the end of this we taking our sleep meds all right that should help just don't stay up watching me for too long I know I'm addictive I know I'm a drug I get a little bit of narcissism as a treat Bird's eye bray. Welcome home. <laughs> Just look at my classes. Shark <laughs> freak crazy ass. The fighter. Uh, do I have any seeds? Can I sow the seeds? I can't sow seeds. Grows in spring. It's summer. These are useless. Spring, summer, and fall. Yeah, whoop. Alright. Now we can have fun starting from the beginning again. I really don't like the sound of that fairy. I'm just saying. Damn! Shit. Alright, and then... Take that. Background noise, like white noise for sleep, that. Or muted, but screen on. Gotcha. There we go. Ship my seeds. Move all. Using crafting to fortify weapons. Put the local coconut in there. Those in there. That, that. There we go. Eh. What is this 3D Stardew Valley? A little bit. <laughs> Kinda, but also a little like Dragon Crest or Animal Crossing too. Eh, I'm not sure if I would throw an Animal Crossing. Looks neat. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a. It's good fun. I've enjoyed it. Uh, Ludmilla VT, our good friend here, gave it to me. Which, by the way, if for some reason none of y'all are following my friend Ludmilla VT, you should probably go do that because she's the reason we have this game. So go do that, or I will eat you, and I'll make it painful. Ugh, I have the game too, but I gotta work on stuff before I can play it. Well, I hope you enjoy it. I'm enjoying it. It's been a cozy little stream game. I'm just getting warmed up. And of course, Mill loves watching me play it. Uh, anything I can make. Also, welcome to the stream, Corey. Glad to have you here. I don't think I said that or not. I shall eat. I 
I've eeped. There's some commotion outside. There's some calm ocean. But we live on the plains. Good to be here. It's good to have you here. <laughs> I relish time to talk to my friends. Like you, like Tommy Cole, like Thornlock. There's a blue fairy. So, so, is the summer seas light safe? More or less. Bless the sirens. Uh, is this another friend of yours? You went and saved the day over by the summer seas light, right? And this is the part where Aria freaks out. What's all this noise so early in the morning? Oh, good. There are more of you. Uh, hope you enjoyed the eclipse. We loved it. It was very nice being in home state. Yeah. <laughs> in spite of the initial paranoia you had about going there. <laughs> uh, is that tone really necessary? We are the great fairies. You should be delighted to see us. Ooh, I'm so happy. I'm the fairy of the summer sea's light. It's a pleasure. All right. Nice to meet you. Anyway, rise. I'll leave the rest to you. Nod. It's like she doesn't care about us at all. That's because you lied to us, Loki. <laughs> I'm sorry I did that. Well, what do you need? You're gonna help with the farm, obviously. You don't work, you don't eat. <laughs> you will starve to death and die and become one with the soil so you'll finally get off your lazy ass and have fucking done something <laughs> right rise that's the least we can do <laughs> i'll just be honest the farm i suppose i could wire the crops or something very well i look forward to working with you stephanie eh, this is going to be tough all right, what are we naming? What are we naming Blue Fairy? Yeah, I had a few hours of driving, but it was definitely worth it. Oh, absolutely. Seeing the eclipse was wild. I was gonna ask anxiety what that place wasn't happy about some things, but we were in a safe area for the show at least. Sleeping are, sleeping are not fucking fun. Twelve hour, sleeping are not fucking fun. Twelve hour drive there and, and kind of back. Yeah. All right, we got that. We got a. We got a. We got a moody Blue Fairy. What are we naming her? I already forgot what we named the green one. I, I, I often forget we named the red one, Stephanie. What's another forgetful... What's another forgetful name we can do, chat? As Luli. As Luli. There. <laughs> A new As Luli order has been added. <laughs> Luna, too late. <laughs> Tommy, go beat you to it. <laughs> It's first come, first served. I would do second some for second come, first served because that's iconic. However, I think people would start getting mad at me for that. <laughs> also, that wouldn't work. Because <laughs> nobody would type. Alright. Water in the plants. Singing in the rain. I'm in great pain. <laughs> you got a letter. Silent screen fairy, I don't like your voice. Fun mind voicing her though. When I played Ace Attorney Investigations, I had a lot of fun voicing Cammy, I won't lie. <laughs> Just that like sleepy, uncaring, like um that sleepy, uncaring, like, uh Wait, 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 hold on, I'll read this in her voice. How are you doing, Rice? It looks like you carried out some remodeling works on your farm recently. Oh, think of it. The farm hasn't undergone any maintenance since the last person moved out. <laughs> like, I, I don't know why. I had so much fun voicing Cammy when I was playing Ace Attorney Investigations. She was really fun to... She was really fun to voice. <laughs> for me. I'm sad. I'm not going to get this year again. Wait, isn't that game only in Japan? Did you use the fan tra translation? That's the second one. The first one was released internationally. But the second one is not. 
and I will um definitely acquire um translations through a uh, completely legal means because I follow the law and I legally own Adobe Photoshop. Apologize for leaving you out on your own to manage that, but I hope you will take it in stride with the fires beneath your feet. That doesn't mean I won't help, however. I've included some crop seeds and more gasoline in this letter. Try lighting them on fire on your new and expanded farm. <laughs> Dress lettuce and you mean the maidle. Alright. God, we got so much shit. Hmm. <clears throat> Hold on. Clear my throat. I still got a lot of drainage from when I was sick. That's all I news. The clearing of the Bola. Greetings, citizens. The summer Bola that floated in the coastal waters of Shitola have been cleared. This is all thanks to the intelligent Ola Division's long running investigation into the Matarola. We, the Lewis King, the Brigada, continue to work hard to ensure citizens in safety Ola. While investigations are ongoing, please avoid the water surrounding the summer seas like Ola until permission is given Ola. The area poses no immediate threat to life unless close contact is made Ola. Castle Ola, Lewis Ola, the Intelligence Ola, Division Ola. Hmm. Monotone voice for Tammy. No, Cammy. Her name was, um, her name was Cammy Meal. Because she was sleepy. And chamomile makes you sleepy. Welcome to Ace Attorney Naming Conventions. It's great. <laughs> I will be so I will be singing in the bar again. I am okay. A lot of sad and painful things have happened, but I am okay. I will be singing at the bar in Shatola as normal Ola. I hope you will come and listen, Ola. <laughs> There's no CC currently for the vid. I turned it on! The fuck? Testing. Testing. Uh, I hate it here. On manage. Not even. The fuck is going on? It's not even letting me change my microphone. Like, it just keeps going to the Razor Siren Mini. Hold on. I have to minimize so many fucking windows. Hmm. I'm not gonna spend too much time on this. Uh, phone and other devices. Do, do, do. And do this. I reset the settings real quick. Oh no. Um. Please don't let me have to do two factor authentication for this. Fuck. Well, we're already this far. If this doesn't work. I'm just, I'm just continuing and I'll just troubleshoot this another time. And then remember 21st night of September. Okay. Start captions, allow, manage, I click to manage, okay, it's letting me, it's letting me choose things again, no it is not. doesn't want me to select a different microphone. On one more, one more attempt. 
We'll go to microphone setup and I don't see anything. Recognize none. Devices. Manage sound devices, okay. Input devices. All right, I'll disable that. I'll not disable that, disable that. Disable that. Disable that, disable that. Disable that. Disable that. I'll not disable that, disable that, disable that. Okay. I think those should be good. Ice manager. I don't think this is going to work. Yeah, it's just not letting me pick the it's just not letting me pick my microphone. I don't know what's going on. It just doesn't recognize my microphone all of a sudden. Well, no, it recognizes it. It's just not letting me pick it. So we're just going to not have captions for the stream, I guess. <laughs> it's cool if it doesn't work currently. We are about to head to bed. Love you, Bubba. Love you too, Tamiko. <laughs> Hope you have a good night. <laughs> yeah, I'm on one monitor. So if I go on a tangent like that, I'm not going to be able to see a single chat. Because <laughs> I am troubleshooting and cannot read. <laughs> This is how my uh, switch switch game streams go. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Oh, for fuck's sake! Now what? Does this shit keep happening, bro? Table output select. Okay, it's working again. Jesus Christ! I've had enough tech issues coming off of this trip. I don't know what I did to my computer on this trip besides plug in a different fucking microphone, but everything wants to break and ruin itself all of a sudden. Enough. <laughs> enough of this shit. <laughs> uh, an invitation to my grand presentation. I feel like we got off on the wrong foot when we first met, so I'm sending you this letter to thank you for all your help with Lorelei. And I also ought and also to offer an update in the world of your favorite legendary inventor. I will be holding a presentation and would love for you to participate. I promise you won't be disappointed, so please stop by the atelier. I look forward to seeing you. Signed Heine. And now there are no letters. Okay. Tangent over. Troubleshooting over. Even though it amounted to nothing. We continue. And we're going to meet with the emo at the bar. At least that's what I said we would do. But I'm going to your step instead. Because fuck you. Alright, let's see. Where is she? See that over that way. Who this? Who are you, sir? What is up with her? Normally, she'd be back by now. Uh, this place is dangerous, you know. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Hmm? Oh, thanks for the concern. But I'm not moving from this spot. Not until my little sister comes home anyway. She's been working in Chateau for a few years now, but it's been so long since she last came home. I thought we'd be back together now that all those kidnappings that had pneumonia riled up got resolved. She's the only little sister I've got, so I want to be the first person she sees when she comes home. Uh, are you going to wait out here forever? 
No, no, I still go home every so often, at least once a month. My wife would be beyond furious with me otherwise. But I'm worried. I can't remember how long it's been since she came home. She even sent a letter telling me she was coming back. Do you think something happened? I'm going to give you fear. Don't think the thought hasn't once crossed my mind. I'm desperate to go and find out myself, but I can't simply just walk away from pneumonia. It is a very rough disease to just let run its course. Of course. Why ain't I think of this sooner? You're a traveler, right? I will have you do my work for me. I need you to go to Shatola and find my sister Ola. If you're about to find her and ask her why she hasn't come home yet, that would be a bonus. I thought that's if it'll stop you whining. <laughs> what is loser thing worried about his sister's safety? What a fucking what a fucking idiot. What a fucking weak person. God. I'd be happy though. I wasn't expecting such a positive response. I'm seriously lucky to have met someone as kind as you. My sister's name is Miss... Missila... My Mycelium? Mycelium. <laughs> sure. <laughs> you might have some luck asking around the tavern in Shatola. You'll know her when you see her. She's got the beauty of an angel. Ha 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 ha. I will just keep moving my shoulders up and down constantly for the rest of this interaction. Getting a good stretch. I'm counting on you. Ha 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 ha. Alright. I like how they... Hold on. I like how they do the um abilities down the bottom. I like it that it's a diamond within a diamond. That's actually really cool. I like that a lot. As the art style remind me of Xenoblade. Oh, this is lit. <laughs> I think that I think they <laughs> took some heavy inspiration from Gar Planes. Like just a thought. Just a thought. Just a gander. Just my personal opinion. <laughs> okay. We have to go find the Xenoblade gang. <laughs> it's important. We really should have gone to the front of this place. I'm going to eat withered plants for energy. Start running. Efficiency. Remember, kids, if you need to get somewhere in a hurry, eat some dry leaves. It'll be horrible. I want you to suffer. Do it. All right, where, where's Estina? There's Estina and her giant fucking hips. She's on top of there, isn't she? Find the scenic view. Couldn't be me. This is not Astina. That is Astina. Hmm. Rise, you made it. Thanks for coming all the way out here. Actually, I gave her a British accent, didn't I? Hmm. Hold, I must grab more Zevia. Cherry cola flavor because we don't have doctor here because we're fucking stupid. I'm grabbing two cans so I don't have to do this later. I'm back. <sighs> it's not the library today. <laughs> it's funny. It's funny that sentence because it just sounds like it's like a state of like weather or some shit. Like, man, it's really not library today. 
It's it, it, it's more it's more of like a a skyscraper. <laughs> it's more of like a it's more of like a manufacturing facility kind of day, not a library kind of day, you know. <laughs> It's a bit hard to talk about this inside the orphanage. Jesus fucking. Every time I see it, like the waist to hip ratio, it just gets more comical than anything. <laughs> uh. It's been a, about a troubling rumor that I've been hearing recently. Apparently someone has been going around senselessly attacking people in the nearby village. There haven't been any fatalities yet. We're not in Mortal Kombat, but the person doing it is elusive and appears unexpectedly. Victims say that she's a lady with long hair, dressed in all black. And she calls herself the Shadow Assassin. That sounds familiar. Hmm. I know, uncanny, isn't it? Let me just put this out there before we continue. This whole thing has nothing to do with me. The person doing this is just using my name. Who would do such a thing? I have no idea. Although I hope that's all it is. The thing that bothers me most is that she's not only using my name, but my likeness as well. If she knows who I am, then given what she's doing, it's probably a stunt to lure me out. That's impossible. They don't know where I am. I haven't heard anything from them all this time. What could they want now? Who are they? Ah. Sorry, forget I said that. I'll have my art go back to a three-fourths angle instead. <laughs> the truth is, I still don't know who's behind all this. But I can't just let it go on. It can't be by coincidence that she chose the name Shadow Assassin. Unless she really just likes Sonic. And Sonic is cringe. For the record, I'm a giant Sonic fanboy. <laughs> Since Frontiers came out, that came back. <laughs> so, Rise, could you help me find the person doing this? We must kill all of the Sonic fans. Or she might come and attack Pneumonia next. Because everyone knows Pneumonia is the number one weakness of Sonic fan. That joke was bad. I'm just going through the rest of the dialogue now. I'm, in sh I'm ashamed. So one thing I must not allow to happen. I won't let anything interrupt the children's peace and happiness. And it will not play Sonic Frontiers. <laughs> Depends on the pay. <laughs> Thank you. But now I'm going to go away and gather more information. I'll get back to you as soon as I find anything out. I'll also destroy a few copies of Sonic Adventure 2 on the way there. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for helping me. Thanks for helping me with the kids. Here's a fucking weird looking mushroom. It's thanks. All right. Um. So that's Estina taken care of. Let's go to Shatola and go talk to Emo. See you later. We should also plant our seeds. So it said it made my farm bigger, but like where? Oh. Well. Hanna. 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 I'll mourn your ing. That made no sense. Yeah. And I got my axe and I got my mace and I love my wife with the ugly face. Eh. 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 That song is a lie. I don't have a wife. Eh. 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 There we go. And now to not plant my new seeds over here. <laughs> now let's see here. Spring, summer, and fall. Spring and summer can be reharvested. Okay. Let's go ahead plant those. Like so. 
the seeds. Isn't this the peak intensive streaming gameplay everyone comes to see? On the farm today? I don't know, Stephanie. Do I want to work on the farm today? Hmm. I don't know, Stephanie. And I'm not, I'm not sure. And give me some time to think about it. I'm very clearly determining whether I want to work on the farm today or not, Stephanie. Farm work is pretty good wing exercise. Just a thought, Stephanie. Think about what you had to say before you stupid and red. Is Stephanie the new Karen? <laughs> we can make her a Karen. She doesn't quite act like it, though. Bam! 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 Alright, and then for these... And after this, Twitch is knocking on my door demanding I send you all to mayonnaise and or Cox internet hell for a little bit. So I'm gonna go ahead, hit the save real quick. And then we're going on a quick little three minute ad break. This is gonna be a great opportunity for y'all to get some snacks, get some food, get some water, use the bathroom, do whatever y'all humans do. But as soon as we're all wrapped up with that, we'll be right back for more hard farm work that we're definitely unsure of what we're doing or not. And jokes that go nowhere, and Estina hating uh, Sonic. Hmm. And we'll probably somehow get back to bird eating dirt. So, with all that being said, bye for now.
Howdy, howdy, everybody. Hope y'all had a good break. Sorry for the um, slightly longer ad break because I have realized um, I kind of forgot to hook up my iPhone to my computer while I was gone. So uh, the charge on it's not the highest. This might be the last segment of the stream. We're on 20%. Just a heads up. Anyways, I hope everybody's having a good time. <laughs> hope everybody had a good break. Hope y'all got done what you need to get done. Same as always. Okie dokie. Go ahead, take care of that. And now we go on our way. Bye -bye. This way. Just with our uh, Stephanie Karen say signing us off. Seaside Town Chitola. Seaside Town Chitola. There we go. Seaside Tola Chitola. Alrighty. So oh, let's see here. We have quest over there, quest over there, quest over there, quest everywhere. Go up here. Find our waifu. important. Hmm. Alright, Emo. That's your chance. Give me your best Riz. Oh, Rise, you came. Uh, came to hear you sing. Oh, thank you. I'm going to take a break soon, and I was hoping we could talk then. In the meantime, please just listen and relax. You sweet. She's completely still. I was about to make a high quality animations joke if she kept barely moving. I was singing, her voice is beautiful. Thank you everyone for listening. Emo, that was so good. Good doesn't cut it, Emo's voice is simply the best. Thank you for singing for us, dear. Your voice always fills me with enough pep to see me through the next day. Thank you, everyone. That's lovely to hear. What a beautiful voice. How do I get a singing voice that good? Do you think you could give me lessons? Oh, well, if you'll have me. Emo, you've really come into your own recently. Oh, you think so? It's hard to put into words, but I feel like your songs have taken on a deeper meaning. Almost like you underwent an arc of your character. <laughs> I'm just glad to be back here, having a drink and relaxing the sound of Emo's beautiful songs. I'm trying to make the most of it since we weren't able to relax like this back when Lorelai was around. He's right. We mostly came here to escape the horror more than anything else. Now we come here to have fun and recharge for the next day. Hmm. That's an Emo I'd love to see a goth. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that's a good one. I'm stealing that. Welcome in, I truly help people. Hope you're having a good day. I think I, f I, think I have a feeling I know who you are. <laughs> Potentially. I might not. That could just be your username. <laughs> it could just be your username. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but it corresponds to somebody I know in general. <laughs> I'm just happy to have my husband out of the house and back in his boat. Draw seven, fuck you. <laughs> uh, <laughs> uh, how about you, Emo? You must feel better now, too. That awful monster was lurking in the sea for so long. What that monster was. Hmm? Did you say something? Ah, uh, no. <laughs> I didn't say anything. I don't speak. Somebody stole my, uh. Somebody stole my translator rock again. Meet, 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 meet. Meep, 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 meep. Uh. You tiring Emo out with all your jibber jabber? Says you, I think you had the most say out of everyone here. Dot, dot, dot. Thank you again for coming, Rise. How was my singing? It was re energizing. That's nice of you to say. Do visit again next time you're in Chitola. Terrible. <laughs> uh, 
They were saying things about Lorelei. They were. Dot dot dot. I'm okay. I'm sad about what they said about Lorelei. But I understand why the people of Shatola feel the way they do. Uh, if only they knew the truth. They need to reach out to the truth. Persona for their ass emo. Huh? Telling the truth of what happened will only upset them. I don't want to do that. I don't mind keeping it to myself. Anyway, I have to go. The patrons are waiting. I'm always here if you need to talk. Bow. Huh. Alright. Uh, so there's that. Got some magic defense, it's physical defense, nice. Also some Lorelei's tears, that is, um... Interesting. Mm. Ah, hey there, Traveler, could you lend us a hand? I'm, I'm struggling to come up with recipes, and I'm asking random people to do my job for me, because I suck ass. All right, there's that, and there's you. Is that you're searching for someone? Well, I'd be happy to help however I can. Her name is Mycelium. Mycelium? Yeah, I know her. What's it to you? I've never seen your face around here. <laughs> the immediate jump from, oh, I've never heard, oh, I know who that. The immediate jump from, oh, I'd perfectly be willing to help you. Yeah, I know her. Why the fuck do you want to know? <laughs> oh, sir, brother asked you to come and find her? Well then, sorry for butting in, I was just looking out for her, you see. So nothing happened to her? Huh? Hmm. Nothing's bad happened to her that I know of. Maybe you should go and talk to her yourself. She's usually working over by the pier now. Meet with Mycelium at the pier in Shatola. Instead of doing that, I'm going to get another quest. Love is just like being swept up by the ocean. Sometimes the waves are fierce and stormy, and other times calm and gentle. Oh, well, my heart is caught in a whirlwind of emotion. That pillar is so fucking sexy. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds rough, we'll see. <laughs> yes, you were listening. I'm in love with a wonderful man. He's stylish and handsome, and he has the gloomy, mysterious air about him. I bet you can guess who it is. No, not him. He is handsome, though. But my heart belongs to someone else. And one I long for is the bartender of this very tavern. All the young ladies come here to admire him. I'm one of them. But can you believe it? Sometimes he sneaks out of town all on his own. What's wrong with that? Can't you tell? It's a secret rendezvous. He's going out to meet his lover. The other pillar and another bar. <laughs> At least that's what I think is happening. I don't know for sure. I'm just paranoid. Delulu, if you might do. <laughs> if only someone would go and find out. Ahem. If only someone could go and find out. Why don't you just ask him? <laughs> simp, she's a simp. Actually, so you're fine. Help people. However, I have known Twitch gets mad at people using that word sometimes. So just to be safe, I'm just going to delete those. You're fine. It's just Twitch being Twitch. Because I have heard of them bonking people for that word. As for why they do that, you can take a guess. It's pretty, I, I think you know why. Did you know I help people was un... Did you know I help people was unusable? I do not. <laughs> because it's, it could be considered offensive. It's... <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> That's really funny. But you could. You seem kind of friendly with him. I know you can do it. For asking people around town about the bartender instead of asking the fucking bartender. 
We're just as antisocial as this bitch. Okay, um, there is things in there. I'm gonna go talk to the things in there. We'll have you know, Rise. Will you have me know? I am very social when I talk to myself. <laughs> yeah, yo, same like me for real. Hello, youngin. So you trying to get some dirt on the bartender? How about this? I've got a real doozy of a story for you. Bartender had only just arrived in Chateau to win. Hey, loudmouth. That's meant to be a secret, remember? Oh, yeah. Oops. I'm getting forgetful in my old age. I don't even remember who this woman is. But if you're getting involved with the bartender, you'd better watch out for that company. It should be fine, though. They probably won't get involved as long as you don't dig too deep. Putting our life at risk so we can get a Delulu woman laid. Truly, this is gaming. Let's see. It's down below. In the deep blue sea. With our salty friends. SpongeBob waits for you and me. I'm going to cut through their conversation because I'm an asshole. Go. Oh, 2 p.m. It's iconic. Hmm. <sighs> Okie dokie, Heine. I am here. And you have circles on the wall. Are they perfect circles? That one has more circles in it. There's so many circles. So, Rise, welcome to my atelier. Do you like the circles I have on the wall? They have circles within the circles. Circleception, if you would. <laughs> Did something about a presentation? Well remembered. I think I'm ready to show on my summary in the Fiesola to the children of Chateaula. We have a lot of poetry and rhymes here. Wait, her her name is letter. That's not. So coral reef. That's a dude. And yes, it's Hein, but I'm saying Heine because I'm fucking silly. I've been calling Nemia pneumonia, <laughs> and I've been calling a character named Asshole asshole. <laughs> so I'm calling Hein Heine. It is my magnum opus. I toil day and night working on it. I can't wait to see the looks on their faces during the grand unveiling. Wanna ride in it? <laughs> it's good to see that even you are impressed by the majesty of my creation. Shakes head, but alas, I'm afraid I require your assistance behind the scenes. Now, take off your pants. <laughs> You mean I can't ride in it? Not this time, I'm afraid. No, you would be something like my assistant. So we get to see the machine up close. Embarrassingly, I can't say I have much experience with hosting such things. And the children are our most important spectators. Surely someone as capable as you would be willing to help. Don't fret, we will go into the submarine with all these children to go see a shipwreck at the bottom of the ocean. And I'll have it controlled by one of these little game controllers. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> um, I guess somebody has to. Thank you. That's so kind of you to say, you fucking smartass. We should strike while the iron is hot. Let's call the children at once. I need to go and make a few last minute preparations. Wait here until the children arrive, would you? Honestly, I don't blame Coral Reef for thinking Hines a girl when every guy in this game, besides like the generic NPCs, are all like fanboys. <laughs> like, look at the pro tag. Man is caked up. And Hine wearing some tight pants. 
Hello, everyone, and thank you for gathering here for the grand unveiling of my submarine. How fortune shines upon you, you who have been this a pioneering innovation. Let's get the ball rolling, shall we? Behold, the sunken ship turned submarine. Now, kids, everybody jump in the water without a life jacket. It's a big metal fishy. That's cool. Did you make this all by yourself? Bowie, you're so smart. <laughs> Pen boys, you say it's perfect then. <laughs> yeah, I mean, look at that luscious hair. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm glad to see you so impressed. If you're impressed by how it looks, wait until you see what it can do. It does stuff too? Give me candy. Can we use it to play dress up? No, no, no. Nothing quite so mundane. What? Then what can it do? I'm glad you asked. You see, this submarine can travel to the ocean bottom. The ocean has a bottom? That it does, an area that remains unexplored to this day. This one, when one fell swoop, this submarine can dive all the way to the ocean floor. And I'm sure there must be fantastical creatures and buried treasure waiting for us in the depths. Certainly nothing that would have giant teeth and a weird angler that glows on its head that would give me nightmares for weeks. So what do you think? Are you not entertained? I love this pose. Uh, is that it? Yeah, I can't make yummy food or play fun games. It can't play Minecraft. It can't go on YouTube. <laughs> How am I supposed to watch Coco Melon on this? <laughs> <laughs> These fucking iPad kids. <laughs> and then it transforms when it gets there, right? Now, why would it do that weight? So the fact it can reach the ocean floor really doesn't impress you. I don't know, should it? Yeah, I was hoping to see something cool. Oh, I thought you were going to show us something neat, like what Mr. F what Miss Fiasola used to make. Ooh. Oh dear. <laughs> I admit defeat. Oh dear. Well, that was hardly my most defining moment. I'll just have to put in more energy towards my next grand presentation. Moving on, with the children returned home safely, I suppose it's time to clean up. So who's Miss Fiasola? I'm going to be nosy. On second thought, I can handle this. Why don't you head on home, too? Thank you for all of your help. I'll be sure to repay the favor someday. Goodbye for now, Rise. What a wonderful, <laughs> what a wonderful presentation. <laughs> that did not dig up past trauma whatsoever. <laughs> I'm just gonna ask Hein about his day. He's just gonna be like, I was traumatized by children. <laughs> they brought up my dead wife. <laughs> I want to die. <laughs> I'm very depressed, send help. <laughs> I'm going to the tavern to hear- I'm going to the tavern to hear Emo sing. Let's hope she doesn't sound like Fia Solo that day. <laughs> Alright, uh, two guys, five feet apart because they're not gay. You're kidding me, he still hasn't come back? I wonder what's going on. Lorelai is gone now, so what's the problem? What's wrong? We're not happy about this. You see that massive building over there? That's a lighthouse. At night it lights up like BAM! We use it as a landmark to help us get back to Shitola when we're out at sea. The second you said BAM, I immediately am breaking out the mobile voice. <laughs> uh, is something wrong with it? I mean, lighting up at all recently. To start it, the lower line started showing up. In the beginning, we thought they weren't switching on the lighthouse because of Lorelei. 
And even now that Lorelai has gone, there's still no sign of the light coming back on. It's a real problem for us, because we can't do our nighttime fishing. Business ain't gonna be booming at this rate. For us people, Shatola, that lighthouse is our beacon of hope. <laughs> it's not shining, it kind of puts a downer on the whole village. <laughs> Emo can't do all the heavy lifting for a depression. <laughs> hmm. What do you mean by beacon of hope? I, I, that's always there, showing us the right way. <laughs> that's your total beacon of hope. That's what a folk used to tell us back in the day. Now we don't know what's going on with it. This is the first time the light's been out for this long. Lighthouse be broken. Never heard of it breaking down before. I love how I just, the young fisherman just has the plainest voice and then fucking old one. I'm just doing my Mo voice from the Undertale Yellow Player. <laughs> oh, what have you heard? I heard that the lighthouse keeper turned into a drunkard and instead of going to work, he's always in the tavern drinking. What? You mean he's just been slacking off? <laughs> Only I'm allowed to do that. <laughs> Apparently, I don't know if it's true though. Lighthouse keeper's always been so hardworking and dedicated. Yeah. Maybe a good check on him for for him in the tavern? The room is true that he should still be in there, still drinking. Ah, that lazy so-and-so. Join himself in the tavern while people like us are out here trying to make a living. How am I gonna be rich at this rate? How am I gonna hit that drink being a drunkard in a bar? Grind said at this rate. You can find him. You can need for both of us, will you? I should be the one getting passed out of the bar, not him. Come on, young fisherman. Let's go scan some people out of their hard earned cash. Some hot chocolate pops. There's a child in this cave. Oh, you've been looking at this spot too, huh? You've got a good eye. Keep this a secret. Can you hear? You can hear a spooky voice when you stand here, like. Coney Coco. This is actually a really pretty cave. Bro. What's over this way? Hey, yo? Suspicious door. So we back in the mine, got our pickaxe swinging from side to side. Business is not booming. I wonder why. <laughs> what do you mean no one comes to this cave? You don't know what he's saying. Oh, who's there? Are you a traveler? You did well to find the hi this hideout all by yourself. Uh. This is the Chief Canelu's hideout. I'm glad you found us. I was wondering how long it would take for someone to find us. This place is top secret. We've been starving for weeks. Do you have food? <laughs> Do you have water? We can't drink the water around here. It's salt water. Yeah, kind of, can't you? Really? Well, that's weird. Anyway, that's not the point. I have a favor to ask. The Chief Canelu says he's collecting Canelu dolls, and he'd like your help in finding them. He says they're scattered in lots of different places, so I can't go and look for them by myself. <laughs> I'd die! <laughs> but they seem really important to him, so I'd like to help him somehow. He says he'll reward you with a nice surprise if you find them for him. What do you say? He says thanks. All right, we'll leave the rest with you. Come All right. I love him. Give the Canelo dolls. He seems pleased with this. All right, I guess that's everything. This mirror sucks. <laughs> Why even? That's what the dolls are for. Found that out.
And we'll activate that. Let's see what's up this way. Hole. Oh shit, it just keeps going. Shit. Oh, there's a chest up here. Silver ore, yay. Bench. I can't sit on the bench. This game sucks. Can I at least jump down from here? No. Oh, no, I can. Okay. This game is still... This game is still salvageable, then. Uh... There's so many fucking quests here, dude. <laughs> I'm drowning. Wanda, the bartender goes out of town. I did see him hanging with Jaden Forrest on its own. Weird, don't blame him. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, nice speed run. Already? Bartender, he's a bit of a mystery. Last time I saw him, he was at the beach staying at the sea. Don't end up like me. I have a feeling I got into some shady business with the last landlord who was at the tavern. All right. Bartender goes to the Jade Forest. Oh my god, and there's another fucking quest. <laughs> glub blub blub, so sparkle, so pretty. With the shiny glub blub blub blub. Is there a monster here? Hmm. Glub, a human. Vuvuzela's time very precious. Price is two million gil made to speak with Vuvuzela. You pay no, you no pay, then you no talk. Now go away. We found it. We got you now. Give us back our treasure. You can't go taking other people's stuff. That's what thieves do. Glub, 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 glub. Vuvuzela doesn't listen to silly human rules. Everything you can see belongs to Vuvazela. Aw, uh, you don't play very fair. <laughs> Give back what you stole. You want to fight Vuvazela? Alright, kick that thief's side. Uh, kick that thief's side against butt. Vuvazela becomes sovereign Sahagi, and you dare call him thief. Or Ocean will become your enemy. Glum. Right now. There are more humans in Vuvuzela. Blum. Vuvuzela retreats. Tell future generations about the evil dastardly humans. Blum bye. It's getting away. Quick, after it. <laughs> I love how it's like, there's more humans in me. I must run. Goes into the human town. <laughs> there's a fire. We need to get out of here. Runs into the fire. <laughs> Can't let that fishy side can go off. Uh... Oh, can we? Fuck, oh, Rosh. You know that. Let's go school on the bat stealing. There's no way we can lose a grown up on our side. We'll share some of your treasure with you when you get back, we promise. Back to the Jade Forest. Vuvuzela. I love that name. I love that we ended off with that guy on the last stream, and I only just remembered him when I saw him. I remember us ending with him. Poor oh lordy. We're just on a quest grind right now. Finally, you're back. Well, what did you find out? Who is she? The secret lover. I heard he goes to the Jade Forest. The Jade Forest? Then there's no doubt about it. He fucks trees. <laughs> Why else would a smart man like him risk going to such a dangerous place? He's doing it for love. A forbidden love. With trees. Ah, I wish I was that tree. Oh my gosh, look. She's wearing green. She's just like a tree. What's your thing, boss? I can't believe it. He's leaving for the Jade Forest now. He's going to meet the person he loves. I can't just stand by and let this happen. I have to go after him. You need to see with my own eyes who it is that stole my love from me. Dangerous for you to go to the Jade Forest alone. Take this.
We need to stop him from fucking a tree. He's gonna get splinters. First, we're gonna go to all the shit down there. Like I said, quest grind. All right, first off, you. Oh, Lord. Oh, hello. Is there something I can help you with? God? Oh, no. Mycelium, who are you talking to? Us. I guess I have some explaining to do. Something happened? Explain the situation again to them both. Ah, I see now. My silly's older brother is worried and asks you to come out and check up on her. But my silly, this is the first I've heard of you wanting to go home. I'm, I'm so sorry. This is all my fault. What's going on? I'm scared to tell Todd about my relationship with Haas. My Selium and I have been seeing each other for the past year. I've mentioned to her several times that I'd like to meet her family, but... You haven't told them a thing about us, have you? I'm sorry. But you see, Todd, he's... Say protective of me would be an understatement. I love how this guy looks more like her... Uh, like what her brother would look like than her actual brother. Oh dear. So that's why you always change the subject whenever I talk about meeting your family. Still, this is all my fault. I didn't have the courage to face Todd and tell him the truth. Oh, my Cillian. Would you prefer to stay here? I have to go back. I was worried enough to send a stranger to come and check on me. It's only right that I stop trying to run away from the situation. I'm going with you. We will confront your brother together. As a couple. Grab the swords. We fight to the death. We'll escort you to pneumonia. It might take a day or two. Y'all don't mind staying at a farm, do you? We'll travel to Nemia, pneumonia together. A lot of shit taking us to the Jade Forest right now. A lot of shit taking us to the Bronze Jade. Oh, Jesus Christ. No way you saw an omen on the beach? Are you sure they weren't just seeing things? I saw what I saw it was an omen, make no mistake. Really? You're not lying? You seem awfully interested in omens. <laughs> you know omen has men in it, are you gay? <laughs> so here's the deal, I saw an omen over on the beach a few days back. It was pretty dark out on account of it being nighttime, but it was there, I could tell by its horrifying shape. But what was it up to? No idea, it just stood there, menacingly. Then after a little while, it wandered off to who knows where. You remember what it said? I don't remember much, but... Pretty sure it was mumbling about the Siren's Village and some impending crisis. What do you mean, crisis? Is Shatola in danger, Ola? Hush your gums, you don't know nothing for sure. That's a new one, hush your gums. <laughs> That's all I remember. You'll have to do your own detective work from here. Thanks for your time. Wednesday was enough to go thanking me over. I'm gonna call a day and sue my nerves with a pint or two. Sounds like a good idea. I'll join you. Ugh. The grind is real. This is about the coral shrine. Uh, Shatola's Chrysola. Okay. Are we done? Son of a bitch, there's something in the tavern. I fucking hate it here. <laughs> Somebody get me out. My vision has become encompassed by nothing but blue, white, and more blue. <laughs> and rocks. So many fucking rocks. <laughs> Oh my god. Oh dad, you've been drinking again. How long are you going to keep this up? The whole town's waiting for the lighthouse keeper to come back. Erg, hiccup. Uh, 
I might have just fucked up my tracking. Hold on. Eh. Are you feeling it now, Mr. Krabs? <laughs> okay, there we go. I wanted to check my battery life on the phone. 15%? Yeah. This will be our last... Once we get to the next ad break, I'm just gonna raid somebody. <laughs> I'm not a lighthouse keeper anymore. Are you the lighthouse keeper? <laughs> Sorry, who are you? Did you want to talk to the lighthouse keeper? Sorry, right now my dad is... Lighthouse keeper this, lighthouse keeper that. Shut up, I'm sick of it. I'm not fit to be called a lighthouse keeper anymore. Dad, where are you going? <laughs> uh, sorry I had to see him like this. What happened to him? I have no idea. Dad won't tell anyone what's wrong. Anyway, what was it you wanted to talk about? As you can see, the last keep, I mean dad, can't talk right now, but I'm here if you don't mind talking to me. Could you turn the lighthouse back on? I can't, I'm afraid. Only my dad knows how to work the lighthouse. Besides, it needs repairing first. Hence, dad is always done the inspections and repairs. I've been trying to fix it myself, but on my own, there's only so much I can do. It's not as easy as just switching the light back on, I'm afraid. Sorry, there isn't more I can do. Let me help you with the repairs! Oh? Are you sure? What do you gain from helping? I just like to help so- I love how triumphant the music is, it's just like, it's him! The savior of the lighthouse! <laughs> Rye bread! Going to save the lighthouse! <laughs> Ignore the fact this man has prevented human trafficking! Um... Dragons destroying a village and kidnapping people and other shit. No, no, no. It, it, it's when it's when he's going to fix the lighthouse. That's when the triumphant music plays. <laughs> a lighthouse, man. <laughs> First of all, could you come to the lighthouse with me? Once I see the exact same, I'll tell you where you can help. <laughs> uh, you know what this means, everybody. We don't get to leave Shatola yet. We don't get to leave Shatola Yatola. <laughs> All these squares make a circle. All of these squares make a circle. All of these squares make a circle. Oh fuck. I might have fucked that up. Okay, I didn't. All of these squares make a circle. 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 I didn't mean to click the door. There's Christmas decorations in here. There's tinsel. I ain't lighting up shit. Shatola? More like Shitola. Am I right, fellas? <laughs> I actually like Shatola, but by God, I've been here forever. <laughs> Ignore the fact you were just in there. <laughs> Pardon the mess. <laughs> Alright, so this is what a lighthouse is like. I haven't tidied up properly, though. Sorry. What am I fixing? Let's see. Well, I have to fix the mechanics, so... I'd like to, you to get the materials for me, but... Ah! I'm going to need quite a few of them. They're from monsters called Robastos. Problem is, they live at the bottom of the sea. I usually buy these kinds of things from a traveling merchant, but they seem to be out of stock because of Lorelei. The core what? I don't know what it is, but you'll have a good idea where to start. Glad I've got you to help. You probably need to feed about five of them to get the materials we need. Thanks, I know you can do it. So he doesn't know anything about the seabed, but he knows exactly how many of these things I need to kill in order to, you know, fix the thing. <sighs> good old game mechanics. Good old game logic. Okay. 
We can leave Shatola. There is no other funny icons on this map. I am leaving Shatola. Shatola is being Leftola. Oh my god. I've been in this fucking ocean for five years. I'm going to hit save before anything happens. Okay. The bronze jade. All right, number one. Okay, let's go. I'd like to clear the forest before it gets dark. We don't want to have to deal with any monsters. Don't you worry, no matter what happens, I'll be here to protect you. Aw, Haas. Oh, we really didn't get along with each other when we first met. I teased you relentlessly when you first realized, arrived in the Chateau. Yo, just like me, for real, for real? I remember at the time I threw you into the sea, we were awful to one another. As you might surprise, me a member of the Vigilante Corps thrown into the sea like I'm nothing. <laughs> I guess that wasn't very nice of me. <laughs> remember how you almost drowned because you didn't know how to swim? That was so funny. Did you hear that? Sounds like somebody's having trouble with a monster. I'll be right back. I have to go help them. <laughs> Yellow shirt power, man, he is a fast runner. Yellow show powers, go. <laughs> right. I love the immediate switch from like dun 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 dun, dun to just calm forest music. <laughs> Help! They're making me hit myself! Please don't eat me, I promise I taste terrible. Claude, why is he out here? That's your brother? He's a fucking idiot. Mm. Come on, we have to help him. Ah, so you grab Todd. Hold him close. You grab his ass a little tightly. <laughs> Switch to this. Oh god, I have no food. I have no food. Help. <laughs> Hold. I need to eat leaves. Leave me alone. I'm eating leaves. Leaves. I'm still alive! Pod. Huh? Mycelium, why are you? That's what I should be asking you. What were you doing out here all on your own? I left so you wouldn't do this. I'm impatient! So that's why you did something so foolish. I'm sorry, Mycelium, I ended up making you worry instead. Is he safe now, eh? Things could have gotten a lot worse. That's right, I owe you a debt of gratitude. I have no idea who you are, though. Uh... Seriously, who are you and why were you with my sister? <laughs> Dude, are you trying to date my sister? Yes, I am. Do you want to die? Yes, I do. Take me, sweet death. How's about we all head back to Shatola? I'm struggling to keep my thoughts straight out here, Ola. We're not going back to Shatola yet. <laughs> Fuck that shit. Hey, where is, um, there he is. He's up this way. All right. <laughs> where is he? <laughs> oh, 
you follow me here? <laughs> there could be monsters out here. Uh, but I... I couldn't help myself. I couldn't rest until I saw it with my own eyes. Brave enough to do that. <laughs> That's different. I promise to listen to you from now on, so please help me find the bartender. Have you seen him by any chance? Okay, we're gonna have to start searching then. Wait, hide! What a lovely woman. Hurry up, he's coming this way! <laughs> what a lovely woman, letting me get eaten. <laughs> oh my god, he is going to fuck the tree. <laughs> Oh, long time no see. Good looking well as always. So do you have it? Yes, here it is. Zip. <laughs> Thank you. Sorry to keep troubling you with this. Don't worry about it. It's my job. See you again in a week's time. that didn't look like a romantic date <laughs> I can't believe it that was clearly something to do with work why did you have to come all the way out here to get it though anyway I'm just glad it wasn't a secret date huh. really got me there he's such a meanie <laughs> that's what I like about him the Lulu <laughs> I know he's in a secret fair shall we go back to Shatola wait maybe I can still catch up to him Ola then we can get back to Sh Shatola together Ola I'm going on ahead. See you later. Let's meet up again in the tavern. But she just ran and just crashed into the wall back there. Dangerous. Oh, hello. Uh, I think that's everything here. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna do this. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna go home. <laughs> <laughs> I'ma be over here. Let's make a few more of these. I need them. For science. Uh do I have the ferment yes I do have the fermenting barrel. I need the I need a flour mill version two. And fermenting barrel version two. I have plenty of repair. No, I don't. I actually have very few repair kits now. Let's fix that. Six hours. There we go. Two hours, 20 minutes. It's very iconic. There we go. And no stellar eat. You feel EP. I will not take hair out there. That's weird. Just taking people's hair? Is that what you do? Has that been part of your research when I'm not looking? Fucking weirdo. Welcome back. Okay. Uh I shall eep. Summer Breeze, day three. We. Oh, oui. Uh, who's coming to visit me? How dare you talk to me? Upon the awakening of my slumber, some weird pony with a horn came to the farmyard. Eh? You must mean unicorn. <laughs> yeah, him, the hoity toity one. Uh, now nah, I think you're right. He was looking pretty gloomy. I think he lives in the forest out here. Would you go check on him when you have him? <laughs> Man's been depressed, and we've just been ignoring him. There's some commotion outside. Again! There's no ocean out there, and it certainly is not calm. Stop it. Is 
There's some commotion over in that direction. God damn it. Lord, I am a slow walker. We really needed that transitionary period. That was very important. Can we get another one? Damn it. I'm saying. Oh. Bellow there. That's new. Ah, uh, we've been found already. That was fast. Well, what do you think of the wa this waterside biome we made? Biome? Like in Minecraft? Yep, yep, biome. Think of a biome as a kind of like a new farm. Some of our cute little veggie friends prefer to live in water. So you can grow them here on this waterside biome. It, it's a good thing, you know? Yeah, you could look a little happier about it. Take it from me. Is that it? Do you even know the meaning of the word happy? Woohoo! <laughs> mm, that's about a 6 out of 10 on my happiness rating. This means you'll be able to grow new crops they couldn't grow before, so take care of them. Oh, uh, and just in case you couldn't tell, you won't need to water the plants in here. Efficient, right? May you grow lots of sweet and yummy vegetables. Don't no, forget to sh- I have like the- <laughs> The most boring pair of fucking voices I could have. <laughs> Don't forget to show us when your cute little veggies are all grown up. You unlock the waterside biome. You can use biomes during spring, summer, and fall. Not winter, because fuck you. <laughs> well, at least I'm right by a save point. Alrighty. So, that's going to be it for today. Because phone's dying. And we are on the precipice of ad breaks. So, I'll just go ahead, tweak a couple things real quick. Switch us back over to chatting. Okay, let's see if I can find us somebody to raid real quick. Do a quick little refresh. Let's try and make this fast. Because I need to use the bathroom. <laughs> uh oh, hello there. Hello there, miss. Hello there, Miss Viz. I don't get to raid you often. Let's go take care of that real quick. There we go. Yeah, let's go give the, they're uh, playing Elden Ring with Buzzbeak VT. So let's go give them some love real quick. Hmm. Alrighty, that's taken care of. So let's talk about what's going on for next week. I mean, not next week, uh, tomorrow. We're getting back in Ace Attorney Investigations. Very excited about that. I've been looking forward to playing that game again a lot. Then Thursday, we'll be doing Arten. We'll be working on CC's comms some more. But outside of that, uh, I think we got a solid plan for like um, the weeks ahead. I might see about getting some collabs. Might see about getting Mill on one of these streams. She was busy today, so I didn't really ask her. But um, outside of that, um, yeah, we're we're in a pretty standard thing. It's good to be back. Uh, this stream went pretty well. I thought it'd be a lot more dead. I thought it'd be a lot more rusty, but I feel like I did a good job. And we had quite a few people show up too, which makes me happy. I'm glad y'all like being here and listen to me yap for two to three hours. It's nice. It's nice. I like y'all. Love y'all. Mwah. Hmm. Hmm. But yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and send us over to uh, the other alien dragon, Viz. So y'all have a good day, night, afternoon, wherever you are, and whatever the fuck you're doing. And y'all have a good one.